Good morning, my gorgeous friends on the internet. In this episode, we are gonna create a 10 minute design website, which means that I'm gonna design a website in 10 minutes from scratch. That's the same thing I just said. Moving on. I'm also on the ground today because I have my reasons, because I care about the planet. I should, I should do like those celebrities that sing a song in quarantine because their life is so tough. Imagine all the people. <laughs> okay, so what's the reason of doing this challenge? The reason of doing this challenge is, especially for people who feel like they're not comfortable coming up with some stuff or craving stuff or designing stuff, right? Because it's very hard to get going and to come up with something. So this challenge I'm gonna do is just literally just design something in 10 minutes and whatever comes out of it comes out of it. The idea here is to get thoughts going very fast, to jump, with ideas and think fast and just do something, right? And this is a great practice and that you can apply everywhere because usually we get stuck and we're like, I, I don't know what to create. Well, put yourself a challenge, try to create something in 10 minutes and just keep iterating, so do it more times. In one hour, you can do it six times. So you're gonna get different results and different prototypes. So again, this is used, this is a very powerful tool used uh, to create stuff. So I'm gonna do it now. It's gonna look terrible, but that's that's not the goal. That's my excuse. Okay, come on, start. Start! I also wanna to thank today's sponsor of this episode, which is this sock. Thank you so much for sponsoring. Link is gonna be in the description. No, it's not. Okay, let's start off this challenge and I wanna be completely fair here and I have not have not made anything beforehand. So as you can see, I just have my Streamlabs open, that's it. Uh, my file explorer here, I'm gonna close that up. And we have 40, all right, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna think about the idea beforehand though, because I don't want that process to take so long. So let's do, I've been thinking about doing something with food. So let's go with food. Now, I'm. you can either go like with photo, um, pictures on the website or drawings, illustrations. So I think I'm gonna do one with illustrations just because it's gonna be harder and it's gonna turn out like crap. So <laughs> let's do that for fun, why not? Okay, so let's start at uh, 49, okay? 49 and till 59, I should be ready. It's 11 in the morning, I'm super sleepy. I was crying in bed beforehand, but it's okay. So let's go. In five, four, a three, I'm cheating, let's go. All right, let's go to Google. I'm gonna search for food, food, food drawing, food drawing. Let's see, images, images, images. And I was kind of looking for, well, that could work, but let's not do that. Okay, <laughs> let's do food illustration, food illustration. Here we go. All right, so this is much nicer. Let's go with this one, or this one. This one looks pretty cool too. Let's just pick out one. No, this is too basic. This one, I like this one. Save, 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 save. There we go, saved. I'm gonna minimize that. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it again, so let's open up Figma Ligma. There we go. Come on, load, there we go. So let's make a new project, new plus plus. Where's the plus? I haven't used Figma in a long time. Why you do this? Okay, there we go. Let's make a frame, frame, desktop, boom, boom, zoom in, zoom out for the for the people. Okay, uh, I think I'm gonna do like, let's let's just throw some text on the screen here. Uh, Asian, Asian sensation is what it's called, all right? Asian sensation, let's make this like super large, 80. All right, this is gonna be super simple. That's good, bring this, uh, where do I want it? Should I put it here? Let's let's put it there. 80, all right, let's add some random text. Here, we're gonna say um, quality Italian dish for the people. Wait, <laughs> this is Asian sensation and I wrote Italian dish. Okay, never mind. it's good. We're gonna keep going with this. Let's do 24, too small. I need more text, Italian. For the people brought to you by Chef Ed. There we go. That's looking better. 24, let's do 32. Make it bigger because I like it bigger. 
bring it, kind of style it up a bit here. Okay, there we go. There we go. It's too, it's too small. <laughs> 42. <laughs> All right, much better. Bring this a bit closer. <laughs> it looks bad. Ed, the chef. Okay, good. Bring it here. Let's make a quick button. I'm gonna search for some styling in a bit. I have a few more minutes left. Let's bring this here. Drag, drop, okay. Position, that's a long button. Let's make it smaller. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like this and we're gonna see what we're gonna do. So let me, let me go here to my files. Files, 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 bring this back. All right, we have this image. I'm gonna make like a, should I drop it in like this? That's gonna look too boring or basic. We're gonna make a splash. So let's go to the pen tool. I'm really bad at making these, so <laughs> we're gonna see. Oh, I told you I'm gonna really bad. I'm really bad at making a nice splash looking thing here, but we're gonna go with that. Close this up, hit done. Let's move this out a bit. Grab, grab this, bring it up. Ooh, I wonder how terrible this is gonna look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like that, done. Now what I wanna do is grab this and kinda position it. I think I need to remove the stroke and fill, and then I need to make this a mask, and then drop this crap <laughs> inside. So let's size this sucker up, and then here, like that, yeah, okay. So you drop in the mask, let's bring it in the frame. Uh, it's the edges are looking like really bad up. Let's do it up like that eh, I guess Let's bring this a bit to the left see I kind of messed up this This vector here and now I don't know how to edit it. Why you do this? Why you do this to me? Oh my god, it keeps grabbing the image. Okay, let's hide the image Double click, there we go. I'm gonna bring this over. Doesn't really look like a splash anymore. It looks like a... <laughs> it looks like my first day of drawing. But it is what it is. I'm gonna remove this one and just re-add it. Which I don't know how to do. Oh, there we go. Perfect. So we re-added this. Where's the handle? Where's the other handle? Oh. Come on. Come on. Add another point. Grab the point. Change the... the... There we go. Alright. There we go. Okay, so now it worked. Why you do this to me? Go back. Go back. Get rid of this one. There we go. Just add it here. There we go. That's what I was want to do. Go here. Push this up. Fantastic. Look at that. Look at that shape. Amazing. I'm wasting so much time right now. Okay. Whatever. It is what it is. Okay. I think I need to rotate this or something though. Because ah, we're gonna keep it like this. Okay, Asian sensation. We have four minutes left, so I'm gonna just sample colors from here. Let's do a font really quickly. <laughs> Google fonts. Google fonts. And there we go. Let's search for something fancy looking. Fancy, fancy, fancy. Can I search for fancy? Fancy. Nah. All right. Quick. Quick maths. Quicksand. There we go. Quick math, quicksand, 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 quicksand. Oh, I like that. Okay, change this one too. Quicksand. There we go. Bring it up here. Grab this. I'm gonna just sample this orange to kind of give it a nice. Uh, let's do this as well. Why not? And make the sticker medium. All right. Then take this. Add some text to it. Like that, and this is gonna be say it's gonna try now. 
All right, let's do 24. Try now. I'm not sure what the contrast level is on this. I'm gonna just do white. It is what it is. If it looks good, it looks good. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Um, grab this, pull it out. Center, center. There we go. Now kind of grab everything. Whoops. Let's group these two. Need to grab the text. And where's the other thing? <laughs> no time. Manually. Alright. Whatever. It's good. <laughs> I just dip it down. Okay. Sure. Something like that. We have our nice fancy illustration there. Good. And then just let's just do a quick logo here. Yeah. Let's do food logo. <sighs> boom, 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 boom. Now we're not cheating. We're doing one custom hamburger. Hamburger drawing. PNG. Come on, give me something good. These are all terrible. Fantastic. <laughs> Tomato. Come on, just give me a hamburger. I am not happy. This looks... I think we're gonna go with the salad. The salad doesn't look too bad. Where's the salad? Here's the salad. Save as... and watch it not be a PNG. It's a JPEG. Why you do this, Google? This is what you get. Regrets. Two minutes. Two minutes. Outline. All right, give me just the outline. Perfect. Just give me a PNG. That's all I want. That's all I want. Please. Please. Save, save, save. And I'll add a custom color to it. Yes. Is it a PNG? Oh my god. Whatever. We're gonna stick with this now. <laughs> Alright. It's called... Um... Burger Mania. There we go. Bring this in like that. That's terrible. But it's okay. Bring this down. We have this. And we have one minute left. Uh, I'll try to search for a better logo. <laughs> and I don't think it's gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. This would look cool. I didn't want to search for a logo, but I, th I think we're gonna stop at this. I also wanted to, yeah, all right, we are we are done. I also wanted to do like another page. I've been thinking about doing something like a card system here. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of what we've done. I really wanted to do some kind of card system with the, uh, just going to like on draw and then search for um, like burger or something. So like burger. And then, what, they don't have burgers on this website? Food. Okay, so I was thinking about doing something like this. Kind of have three cards. Well, this is going to squish it. But have like a card system. I thought that was going to look cool. So like this and like this. Align that. And they have this thing. Kind of drop it in here, you know, like very small. Whatever, we're gonna kind of manually do it like that, something like that. And then I have some text here about like the food. And also I wanted to take this and kind of sample the colors from it. Oh, there's a cool new thing you can do in Figma, by the way, you can do selective color. So as you can see, these are all the colors in the picture. And then you can select one and just change those. See, so it only changes those. So again, kind of wanted to do something like this. So just get, grab a muted color. I'm not sure which one. And then just make everything like from this. Uh, of course the burger. This is not the burger, this one, no. Just give it this orange color, you know? So it kind of matches everything up. Oh, there we go. So kind of take this and then maybe change this. But you get the point and just make this super nice with some white and then the drop shadow on it or something. Like this is kind of how I would make it if I had more time. So I'd like a big blur to this, like 10, 20. 
change this to zero and this one to like 10. All right, and then just add the radius and whatever. And just make a nice card system. Anyway, this is, <laughs> this is kind of what you can do in 10 minutes. Hope you had fun, hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, let me know, post a challenge on you doing a design in 10 minutes. Let me see what you can come up with in 10 minutes and I will pick a winner. And we'll do a, we'll do a video on that too for funsies, all right? So I'm gonna go pick up the bottle that I just dropped. It's been a tough day. All right, everybody, I'm joking. All right, take care and I'll see you when the green screen goes away. See, it was the room here all along and you didn't even know. <laughs>